What the... It's a city? A whole city that's floating in the air! Upside down? Just look at this place. Doesn't it remind you of something? W wait, what was it again? Yes! That's it! It's just like that. Just as strange, just as upside down, and just as spooky. In which case, maybe whatever is going on in the chasm really is connected to the Abyss Order. Oh, we gotta get to the bottom of this. Oh? Hmm. The feeling is mutual. I certainly hadn't expected to meet you here either. Long time no see, Dane. Wait, but how did you suddenly end up here in the chasm? The chasm? So we're in the depths of the chasm, are we? Interesting. This is one place where I have never set foot before. I understand how you must feel. Last time we met suddenly and parted hastily. Now our paths cross again. Fate, it seems, owes you an explanation. That much should be self-explanatory. I came upon the trail of another Abyss Herald recently and began pursuing it. Unfortunately, I got as far as cornering him before he resorted to the same trick that they all do. I was hot on his heels when I followed him through the portal, but, as usual, it was to no avail. It took me to the wrong place. Correct. Based on my recent experiences, I can only conclude that the Abyss's portals are not simply pathways from point A to point B, but gateways to an entire network. Where they emerge on the other side is their choice. It can be anywhere within the network. Sounds kind of similar to how teleport waypoints work. In short, though I was right behind your twin last time when I entered that portal, the next moment that I realized where I was, I was all alone, back in the ruins known as Storm Terror's Lair. Oh yeah, about that. Whatever happened to the Eye of the First Field Tiller? It's in a safe place. You can be sure that I will learn the truth of the Loom of Fate operation sooner than it could ever fall into the Abyss Order's hands. Huh. So that title stuck in your memory. I by no means went out of my way to conceal it from you. It once stood for the glory of Kanria, but now it is but a cruel joke. My curse to bear. Twilight Sword was my title as Captain of the Royal Guards when I witnessed the destruction of my entire homeland firsthand. I believe my reluctance to raise it in conversation is quite justified. Sounds like your brother was right. We were travel partners. We both partook in a painful journey of searching for our fate. But regrettably, we did not make it to the journey's end together. Before you continue questioning me, I ought to warn you. If my suspicions regarding the portal network are correct, then the fact that there is a portal leading here tells us that the Abyss Order has their eyes on this location. You mean, the Abyss Order is plotting something here? Actually, Paimon and the Traveler suspected that too! I mean that it's highly likely that even as we speak, the Abyss Order is watching our every move. <sighs> Don't say that! You're giving Paimon goosebumps! <laughs> A wise choice. Hmm. There appears to be light from a fire coming from near that rocky wall. Let's take a look. <laughs> 